So I'm Bill with 3D Chameleon, and uh, here at Murph we're showing off a couple things. One of them is the uh, 3D Chameleon installed on the bamboo printer here. Uh, this is the printer it shouldn't be able to be installed on because it's closed source, but here it is. Um, the really cool thing about this is this actually is a, you could say competitor to the AMS, but in reality it's, it's, it's there's four reasons why it's better, how's that? One, you can use any spi any uh, filament with it. Two, it's 150 bucks cheaper. Three, it's 33% faster because you're not moving big distances, uh, uh, the filament big distances. Uh, and four, uh, it's easy, it's uh, reliable, it's uh, you know universal. It works on every printer. So I've also got it down here on the uh, Prusa Mini. And uh, as an example, so this is our latest version, the Mark 3.1. And the Mark 3.1 has uh, a couple extra features in it that allow it to have uh, uh, any length of loading and unloading that you want. That's a big change for us because what that allows you to do is it allows you to have any number of them on a printer. But the other benefit is, is a lot of people don't like necessarily to have this right at the Y adapter, uh, the Y adapter right at the extruder. It allows you to actually move it and hide it behind the printer, right? Um, the second benefit of being able to have any distance is now you can have any number of 3D chameleons on your printer. So not just one or two or eight like in the old version, you literally can have 64 if you wanted. So lots of color available there. You can see this blue and black and we're gonna add yellow and white to it and it'll be a full fidelity image. It's such an amazing print when they're done. Check it out. Can't wait to see it. Yeah. Thank you, Bill.